Hello, this is just a uh, quick recording to talk through a very interesting problem that I just had to deal with. Um, so currently I am uh, teaching an Excel course and one of my students was having a problem using Solver. So um, whenever they would load up uh, Excel and they would uh, enable the Solver add-in, uh, they would get one of two errors, and that would be uh, this one right here, where it would say Visual Basics for Application, Compile Error in Hidden Module Solver Code. Uh, this error is commonly occurs when incompatible version, yada, yada, yada. Um, look online to try to find some resolution for this. You won't find anything. Uh, I've tried several different places. I could not find anything. Uh, the second error that he would possibly get was this one where it cannot run macro solver.xlam get group label. Macro may not be available uh, in this workbook for all macros may be enabled uh, or disabled. So uh, these are the two error messages that he was getting. Uh, and I'm sorry, I can't, I wasn't able to reproduce this on my personal machine. But uh, one of the things that we ended up deducing and finding out was that um, his machine was actually an Asus computer that he bought. Uh, it came preloaded with a bunch of software. And one of the pieces of software that uh, it came preloaded with was this uh, WPS uh, office. So um, in the, um, it, it comes preloaded with this, uh, and we, sorry, the version of office we were installing is like Office 365. So the latest version as of uh, February, 2022. Uh, he also had the same error with Office 2016. I recommended he installed Office 365 and it still had the exact same error. Um, but uh, really randomly in some form, someone one off suggested, hey, I have an Asus computer and I had this problem with uh, when I had WPS Office installed. So what you should do is uninstall WPS Office uh, so we uninstalled WPS Office, went through that uninstall procedure. I also checked the, uh, I went to uninstall and then I got rid of all the configuration stuff. Um, we then did a repair on the install of uh, Excel 365, but that alone did not fix the issue. After doing that, we had to go in Excel and actually disable the um, the add-in, the, um, oh, where's my Excel? We had to disable the, um, the solver add-in. So uncheck that, clicked OK, shut down Excel, started up Excel again, went back here, added the solver, clicked OK, and then we finally clicked solver, and it actually worked. It loaded solver, no problem. So this is probably going to help two people in the world, but uh, I could not find any information on it whatsoever online. I'm going to try to put as many keywords of all the errors that I found together in this, uh, and hopefully this helps someone. Good luck. Uh, feel free to drop a comment below if you're still having that problem uh, after trying all these steps.